Hi. Welcome to Love and Forever Evolving, where we are always and forever evolving. Hello, Aquarius. Welcome back, my loves. Welcome to your love reading. I hope all has been well, Aquarius. Hope you've been taking care of yourselves, eating plenty of fruit and vegetables, and taking care of that beautiful, sexy temple of yours, Aquarians, as it takes care of you, my loves. Welcome back. Shout out to the Evolving Spirits. Shout out to the Patreon Soul family as well, gang, gang. I appreciate each and every one of you all. Thank you so much for your love, your support, your comments, your feedback. Your love never goes unnoticed on this platform, Soul family. And welcome back, Aquarius, as well. To the ones that are new here, it is an honor to have each and every one of you all to stop by and listen in. Definitely, if today's content or video or reading here fulfills and resonates for you, don't forget to like, like, share the content here, Aquarius, with who you know the reading today may resonate for. And definitely make sure to subscribe, Aquarius. We would love to have you here, a part of our soul family as well. All right, this week we are focusing in on the color blue. Yes, we're focusing in on working on our throat chakra this week, expressing ourselves here spiritually, mentally, and emotionally. So definitely, if you're new here, keep up with the community board as well. That is where I do post the new colors that we transition into each week. I also provide daily enlightenment there as well to get you along your days. And if you would love to join us for Wake and Tarot, where I do go live throughout the week for all Zodiac sign readings. If you would love to stop by and get a check in there before you get your day started as well, Aquarians. All right. So no further ado, let's dive into your reading today. First, we're going to start with an oracle message here. From your guardian angels and your ancestors there to see what they want to inform you for this week. We will also will dive deeper into your love life here with the traditional tarot deck to see what messages are coming towards you for love. And then we'll finish up with my raw tarot deck that I created to give you more insight details in regarding the current energies that are surrounding you at this time, Aquarians. All right, so let's dive in. Wow, we have the Knight of Fire here. This card indicates passionate, adventurous, all right, restless, and self-assured, okay? A sudden event that needs immediate attention, Aquarius, all right? So there is some type of situation or circumstance here, whatever you're currently processing here, and trying to figure out a solution here I for or for, excuse me, it needs your immediate attention here. So whatever you're trying to manifest or move forward here with, it says time is of the essence, okay? Think things through carefully, all right? So look like whatever offer or ideal or opportunity here that's coming your way in this night of fire, aka night of one's energy, you want to make sure to think things through carefully. This could be an offer coming in from a fire sign here as well, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries energy here with the Knight of Fire energy, all right? But however, time is of an essence, so your guardian angels and your ancestors want you to be able to think quick on your feet because there is a sudden event that may need your immediate attention for you to be able to be quick on your toes, to be able to make whatever decision here that's coming in for you in the night of one's energy. Wow, beautiful messages from your guardian angels. Let's now dive into your love life. Wow, yeah, look at that. The ace of pentacles here. You definitely have an opportunity, Aquarius, that is coming towards you. Right, that this is the opportunity for love or this is an opportunity within your career. All right, you definitely have an opportunity here being shown with the Ace of Pentacles here. Okay, this may be in the form of your finances or your career with an increase in your type of 
career or establishment or working environment that you're in. You may be getting a promotion here for some of you all. Others of you all, this is an offer when it comes to a partnership here. Someone who actually wants to work with you and collaborate with you and build generational wealth here with you and is willingly to invest here in whatever material things that is to allow the relationship to be met its needs okay so that's going to be different for every every one of you all excuse me but you do have an offer coming in for some of you all financially wise here others of you all when it comes towards a love offer or a love partnership here all right so let's see what else i'm loving it so far Wow, we have the Hermit cards here. This is Virgo energy here, Aquarius. Some of y'all, this particular person here could be a Virgo here. But however, this card indicates going within, all right? May needing to isolate yourself from people, uh, situations, or circumstances here. Something that may have caused you to go within because of a situation or a circumstance here. Your focus. You're going in and seeing what needs to be released here. What no longer serves you in order to move forward and go towards these new opportunities and beginnings, I feel like, for yourself. A lot of you all are doing some soul searching, some healing, all right, some learning when it comes to learning for whatever future ideal that you have that you're wanting to manifest here. And you're needing to make sure that you have all your ducks in a row here. All right, let's see what else. Yeah, look at that. We got the Eight of Cups here. This is Scorpio energy here, Aquarius, which indicates you or this person or whomever this is that is walking away from a situation or a circumstance here that no longer resonates for them. All right. Again, this could be a Scorpio or a water sign. Maybe some of you all are deciding to separate yourself from is why you're going into hermit mode here. You're trying to collect your thoughts as well and see what is the best opportunity for you is it staying here in this particular person's space do you feel fulfilled do you feel happy here all right if not some of y'all have already decided to walk away from this past relationship or connection here to go towards what you feel like is going to be better for you all right so i definitely do see some endings and some new beginnings here that are going to be taking place here in the future for you all Wow, Aquarius, beautiful messages here for you so far. Again, definitely, if the reading so far is fulfilling your spirit here, giving you some insight, some confirmation here on what you were already intuitively picking up about this situation here, don't forget to like, subscribe. Again, we would love to have you here, Aquarius, a part of our soul family. Again, I am now back available as well, Aquarius, for personal readings. If you would love to book a personal reading with me, all that information loves is down below in the description box, all right? So as I mentioned, I want to use my raw tarot deck that I created to see what other additional info we can get from the surrounding energies around you at this time. And the first card we had out was, I wish you was here, all right? So whomever you may decided to depart yourself from or remove yourself from, all right, this person now misses you and wish that you was here with them, okay? This may be an ex here of yours. This could be a family member here, someone that you decided to remove yourself from so that way you can go off and figure out what it is that you need to do to establish here for yourself. Yeah, look at that. You only matter, okay? So someone here wants you to know, Aquarius, that you is the only one that ever has um, mattered to this particular person and in their life. Yeah, look at that. I'm not letting go so easy. So whoever this particular person here is, is someone that, again, that you decided to walk away from. And I just noticed that she has her blue dress on with her blue handkerchief here. But however, this person, again, is not going to let you go so easy, okay? This person is going to try to definitely do whatever it takes here i feel to gain you back in their good graces here or it's sad that it takes you having to literally physically get up and remove yourself from a relationship for someone to want to apply themselves now as you apply yourself to remove yourself isn't it crazy how that works 
yeah look at this this is not over so someone is like no aquarius you are not leaving this is not over i will do whatever i need to do to gain your trust back here i'm picking up here as well someone is definitely having a difficult time or a hard time with letting you go yeah i will treat you right so someone has now made up their mind or someone has now got an understanding that they need to treat you right, period, point blank. Or you're not going to tolerate it. You're not going to be around. And you're definitely not going to entertain this person in their energy here. Yeah, you told me the truth. So this person is aware that whatever you may have informed this person or called this person out on here. All right, this person now know that you were not trying to do anything but just tell them the honest truth here Aquarius right so let's see let's get more on this before we close out wow powerful reading here so far yeah look at that I wish things were different so a lot of wishful energy here with this particular person here I or this is not the right time so this person felt like that maybe when they wanted to come in and communicate with you they feel like it wasn't the right time, but now this person wants to come in here again and communicate with you. Sounds like this person wants to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation here, Aquarius. Yes, we have that don't matter, okay? So this particular person here wants you to know that that don't matter. Whatever may have happened or transpired in the past here, this person is no longer focused on. All right, whatever behavior, patterns that this person may have had, something that you did not agree here with, Aquarius, and you let this person be known about it. And because you have addressed it, this situation and brought it to this person's attention here, now they're taking it more, it sounds like, into consideration of what you said. All right. So whatever you said, keep doing that. Keep speaking your truth. We're definitely utilizing and working on our throat chakra this week. Thank you so much, Aquarius, for your continuous love and support. I appreciate you. And we definitely shall chit chat soon, my loves. Bye-bye.